Man Cave. Hello, welcome back. Good day. It's I, the Somnium Files. Stepped in gum on my way to the station. Mm-hmm. How are you? I think I'm ready to have fun. Things are twisted. Things are so twisted. Things are happening. Have you been thinking about the timelines at all? Yeah. I've been, my brain has been like, I try to remember everything. And it's uh, difficult. So I can't wait for the... Tom's still here, man. I'm living six years in the past. <laughs> You're living six years in the past. It sounded like one of us had a thing on. Oh, it could have been but me. It's fine. Uh, but yeah, let's let's roll into it. Let's uh, let's get whoa, on whoa, 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 whoa. Date's wacky ride. God, I hope the game auto saved. It probably did. No, we do. One of us does. Spill it already. Oh, yeah. You've got to be kidding. Who killed them? I hope you stay happy forever. And by you, Freya. BB, huh? BB. So we're actively fraying the, the reality of this world is what I'm understanding. Yeah, that's what I do with all my games. <laughs> you do sometimes out, uh, end up out of bounds. Oh, right. Congratulations. That timeline didn't happen. They're not together. I like this part. It's very good. I'm glad <clears> we get to see it again. <gasps> oh. Oh. Ah, what the fuck? This is information <laughs> overload. My brains are gonna float out of my ears. I, I really Jeez. like the delivery. Just relax. Yeah, it's good. Like the fuck? Uh. <laughs> I can't just relax. What is this corpse doing here? And why are Kizzy and Leon here? Oh, and most importantly, uh. who the hell? What? Isn't it obvious? <laughs> Wait, you're that stupid porno mag collecting old man. No. No? Yes. Yes. Why are you dressed like that? Where is Guinea? What are you doing here? And one last thing. Where have you been the past six years? Why didn't you try to contact me? Oh. I'm sorry, Mizuki. Secret mission? Secret mission! Secret mission. Okay, I think I kind of get it. Six years ago, Date lost his memory when the ceiling collapsed on him. Oh, right. Then he got captured by terror, but managed to escape. And he's been wandering the earth for the past six years. In a Tommy. Five days ago, on the 10th, he heard the news about Jin's body being found. And finally got his memory back. That's right. Baby time! Oh! My voice, my voice reaches Date's brain right now. That is because there is a reception device in his left eye socket. You can mute me by turning it off, but that's a real hassle, so it's still on. This is the same for Mizuki Kurunu Kur Kurunushi. She hears my voice too. Hmm, Mizuki Kurunushi's kind of long. I'll just call her Bibi. 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 Uh, oh right. An effective way of training. Uh, deadlift. Train the deltoids. Good for butt lifting, too. I think I picked that last time. Maybe. Should I play some things? Sure. I missed the last episode. Or perhaps? Of all the episodes, it had to be that one. Damn you, D&D. Hey. Jokes aside, I encourage you to look back and half. Terror has destroyed your donation. Figure out too. how it all fits together. Small things start to make sense. Like how our boss threatened to fire Iuki because he shot at a guy. Yeah. Two halves. Yeah, that makes sense. Travis! <clears throat> Absolutely. Yeah, we spent some time last stream just kind of mulling it over. Just being like, wait, what? And wait, I what? I was... think I got most of it. Yeah, right? Definitely uh, add some replay value, though. Oh, for sure. When you, you can go back and play the timelines in, in like, correct order. Oh. Yeah. Oh. I'll keep playing some things. Oh. Boss Long so man. Oh. It looks like it could suck me in. Thanks for being a golden waffle. Something wrong, Mizuki. 
head trauma? Just finished the game a few hours ago. Not gonna lie, I haven't been this confused with the game since Kingdom Hearts towards the end. <laughs> Lol. Hey. Enjoy the rest of I. <laughs> Thank you, Longy. And thanks for being a golden waffle. There's definitely some flavor text somewhere. Uh, try the soup pot. I, there's bound to be flavor in there. Uh, nope. Well, I guess I was wrong. Damn you. The big brain bit to do today would be to play XC3 while trying to gaslight us into thinking it's AI, <laughs> me and vice versa of the 230 stream. Is, hey. is, oh, that would be big brain. It's like a <laughs> helix. Suzu! Thank you, Suzu! Thank you. I'm, uh... I'm out. I gotta replenish my stock. So. Oh, no! At least I think so. We don't have another bottle hiding, do we? Uh, check, check in that door. Open it up, see what's inside. Is it just duster? Are you gonna have to do a shot of duster instead? <laughs> Don't do that. That was a joke. No. Dust it. Yeah, I gotta grab some. So, cheers. My, I saw someone with a shirt that said, "Gaslighting's not real." <laughs> it's like, okay. Wait a second. It's Kizzy. It's my, uh, original. my original BB. This stupid perverted porno meg collecting old man. Also, my adopted father. Ugh. 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 Gross. All right. Oh. Oh. Well, that's that. Where do I even start? Let's start with you two. Uh, you know what? Let's start with Kizzy. So about BB. I suppose Big Sis has already told you everything. Ah. Uh. Big Sis and I lived in the same home for six years. But I never thought my Big Sis was my Big Sis's Big Sis. Uh. So confusing. Yeah. Anyway, Mizuki Date, I will call you Little Big Sis from now on. <laughs> Little Big Sis. Yes, Mizuki Kuranushi. I, I love that game for P3. Big, 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 big Sis, of course. Still, just as confusing. BBS. Mizuki's baby clone, Date already, uh, Date already knows this. BB told him. But Kizuna and Leon don't know this yet. They think they're just sisters. Ah. Uh. So, I heard you went missing. I am a little embarrassed to admit this, but Leon and I plan to elope. <gasps> May I ask why? What? Kizzy's father won't accept me. Mm. He threatened to send Leon to prison if he continued to see me. And that's when I suggested that we run off together. And I agreed. So you two... Yeah. They're both on the run for love. Gonna make like Autobots we and roll exactly out. Where we want to go yet? Atami. We need some more time to think about it. Atami. Did you tell Richie? I have told him that I am safe and sound. Okay. Well, I'm glad you weren't kidnapped. I am so sorry that I worried you. Yeah, I'm sorry about all this, you guys. Are you okay? You cold? It is snowing outside, but do not worry about us. My heart is burning strong. Just like the temperature in a tummy. Woo, true! At all times. So, what time is it? Game time! No. It is currently 4.25 a.m. No reason. Daybreak is close. Whoa, in the wintertime daybreak at close to tw like 425? Different it must be like, part of the world. yeah, very far south. Why are you here? I told you that we wanted to run away together. And I wanted to be with Leon. I got a call from my old pal Date. Ooh. I asked him to unlock something for me. Ah. Are you talking about the freezer? No, I got that open on the 13th. It was a different lock this time. Anyway, that is when we met with Date and the woman he was with. The woman? I was there too. Are you the woman? I think so, yeah. Okay, good. About BB. I've known her for a long time. She's a former co-worker from back when I was doing bad stuff. Oh. Back then, I used to call her Quartz. Ah. Oh. Hey, don't just blurt that out. Mizuki's name comes from Crystal. The kanji for Crystal can be read as Mizuki. Ah. Crystals are the solid form of silicon dioxide, a mineral. 
most often recognized as quartz. I Wait, love quartz so crystals. You were in a thieves guild, baby? The snow isn't letting up. <laughs> Don't change the subject. Where's the real Genny? I don't know. Not here. It's fine. Fair. I know where he is. Don't you have an idea too? With Abyss? a mommy. With a mommy. So when did you find out about the corpse in the freezer? Last night. Huh? Date called me out of the blue. He told me about the corpse. Want to see a dead body? And how he was pretending to be Genny. And everything else he knew. And he also sung to me like Goofy. He <laughs> sung me my immortal. <laughs> uh, Evanescence. Evanescence. Oh. BB. BB. But what? BB. Oh, nothing. I just wanted to call you by that name. BB. You. Let just me so say just one thing. I doubt it's just one thing. Let's start with that. Oh, you think? What? Do you have more insults to hurl at me for missing six years of your life? No, it's not that. Maybe she just wanted to hear you say, Mizuki, you've grown so much, or something emotional like that. I just realized how weird it is that both Date and Boss both have a Mizuki now. <laughs> you got one? I want one! Yeah. Mine's the upgraded no, model. <laughs> yeah, either. right. Ah, right. For you, it's been six years. For me, it's different. I've been back for four days dressed like this. I've been watching you guys the whole time, so I don't really have anything sappy to say. I told you it's not that. I'm home. Welcome back. Is that what you wanted to hear? All right, okay. Let me try this again. Mizuki, I'm home. Aw. Welcome back, Date. But that's oh. not what I wanted to say. I threw away all your porno mags. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. I doubt she could find them all. He's still got a stash somewhere. Oh, for sure. There's like a tungsten boss, a uh, box somewhere. So, corpse in the freezer? Let's talk about it later. Okay. Trust me, if I explain it now, it'll only confuse you. Corpse in the freezer. No sense. Why are you pretending to be Genny? Well, I know that Horidori Institute and Nyes are both caught up in the HB case. Gen was created at the Institute, mm. and he was acquaintances with Tokiko. So, by borrowing his mask, I could snoop on Tokiko and other members of Horidori Institute. But why do you still look like that here? Horidori Institute and Nyes people come here all the time. Oh. Imitating Gen makes it easier to eavesdrop on them. Huh. Well, I never considered, but that makes good sense. Why did you reveal your identity now? I'm gonna be honest, this has gotten way out of hand. I can't do this on my own. We need to work together to stop their plan. Their plan? Yeah, the Nirvana Initiative. So first, I contacted Mizuki Kurunushi. Date and I met six years ago. He knew how to get a hold of me. I shared everything I had and told her to find you, Mizuki. To help stop them? Basically. Then why did you shoot us first? Okay, I'll ask again. What's the deal with the corpse? Why is it in the freezer? It's better that you see for yourself. Let me just show you. Another corpse? No, not one more. Another half. Not one at all. It's half. Point five. Oh, who's gonna be here? Oh, yeah. So, you finished reading the file? Yeah. Now do you understand? Now you know whose left half is in the freezer. Jin. Jin Furue. That's what he really looks like. And this body? 
Uru Somazuki. Terror. He murdered three people six years ago. Jin, Chikara, and Andy's Komeji. Oh boy. This is all a bit messed up. What's in the box? What's in the box? Uh, do you want to play two things before we move on? Yeah, I want to play some things. Let me play some things. Here we go. Do you reckon I could get the cardboard cutout company to saw a cutout in half or twist it up? <laughs> I kid, I think they're sick of me now, Lamar. <laughs> Ellen Gale! No. That would be really funny. It's <laughs> just like, oh, God, yeah, you okay. again. <laughs> no, there is, I imagine there is definitely someone who has ordered, like, 60-plus cutouts of different Ariana Grande oh. poses or something. That's oddly specific. <laughs> Don't go in the basement. <laughs> Is that why you want okay. to trade rooms? Listen, okay, I can't make any decisions without passing it through the Council of Arianas. Okay, it grows. Every time she gets Do a new outfit. Do you still have Brave Exvius installed with all your Ariana party? Shut up. <laughs> you mean the Ariana trials? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Also featuring Katy Perry. The Japanese versions of Little Big Sis and Big Big Sis are Koni-sama and Duni-sama, which I find kind of fun tongue. Simon, it's, it's cute. It's very cute. How so very cute? <laughs> Thank you, Simon. Oni-sama. Oh, such respect. <laughs> Obviously. One more? One more. Yeah. One more. Oh, Oni-sama. <laughs> the Grande Council. Someone saying I'm home and someone else replying welcome back is how Mizuki defines a family in AI1. Aww, yeah. It's so sweet. Gestred, thank you. Thank you, Gestred. It's destroyed. Tokiko must have written this. The wall is partially broken. There's a hidden file. What's in the box? Uru's right half. This box. What's this? There's some kind of device in there. Oh, wait, we saw yes, this before. We did, yeah. Nozzle device. It's a flamethrower. Hmm. So if you open the box, you get flamethrowed. Like in a uh, Home Alone esque situation. Oh, yes. I, my is favorite part of Home Alone. <laughs> you don't remember the part where he literally like lit one of their heads on fire? Oh, yeah, I guess he did. He <laughs> did. He was not a good child. I mean, it depends on... Okay. Well, Let's not get into the, the philosophy. The, the morals of, of Home, Home Alone. Alone. <laughs> the real villain was the parents. Absolutely. You changed? That outfit was so hard to move in. With the wireframe and all the stuffing. Are Leon and Kizuna okay? Leon and Kizuna aren't here right now. Man. We split at Brahmin. <laughs> Careful. They're not going far away, are they? They should be fine. They said they were going to think hard about where to go. About Jin. I don't need to explain it. You should already know. Jin Furoe, the child of Tokiko and Chikara. You know, this, this checks out a lot more than the other Jin. He was born with a rare and complicated disease. It caused inoperable tumors to grow in the right half of his body. Jin might have had it worst of all. He got his first transplant when he was really young. I don't think he wanted to take organs from Uru. Remember what it said in Uru's diary? He said he wanted to apologize. I think he is referring to Jin. So you think the transplant was done against Jin's will? I'm not positive, but that's just the feeling I get. Baron Pervert. <laughs> Mr. Baron Von Pervert. Baron Von Pervert. Always chasing after those silly earls. Um, so about, when did you get Only here? a few hours ago, around 1 a.m. I asked Leon to open the door to the staircase. So the lock you mentioned earlier. That's right. The lock to the staircase door. That's when I asked them about their plans to run away together. Then the four of us headed down the stairs. Leon carried Kizuna down. And that's when we found the corpse on the ritual platform. So wait, we're in the Leon and Kizuna runaway timeline? 
No, wait. I don't know. I'm going to keep playing things. Yeah. Unless the real gen has just been hiding under the counter the last few days, this canonically must mean date is a cook rivaling Jen and Ota. <laughs> Ellen Gale! Right? Stop trying to post in that timeline. I just want to live in that timeline, okay? Where they run it was a away good together. timeline. It was such a good timeline. Of course, we're in the Atami timeline. Of course. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> you probably shouldn't laugh anymore. I recently just subscribed to your channel and been watching one of your old streams, Paper hey. Mario the Thousand Year Old Door. Love that game and your stream is awesome too. Thank you. Kira! I it's a had good game. so much fun with that game. We played Super Paper Mario, which was also <laughs> a really fun time. Yeah. That was the timeline with the Bitch Avengers. You are you are correct. <laughs> uh, one more, one more. Hello, long time no see. I finally had my spinal fusion surgery to correct my scoliosis. I'm one month post-op today. Oh. How are you two today? <gasps> Smiling hey. face with hearts. Smiley <sighs> face. Heart. Eye. Mouth. Eye. <laughs> <laughs> Amy! Amy! Congratulations! That's awesome. I hope that you feel a lot of relief. Um, I knew someone who had scoliosis pretty bad. She was a painter. Uh, she had to like rig her canvases up to be like suspended above her so she could paint lying down. Oh, wow. Really cool person. But yeah. I hope you're feeling good. Yeah. Glad you can be here. How did you find out? Slowly healing. I get used that Marco's x-ray function. Marco? <gasps> the name of my AI ball. Guy yes. ball! Guy ball! Marco! Oh, Marco. I wish it was Mario. Do you think... Oh, I'm... Oh! Ooh! 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 Okay, go. Guy ball. He's pretty shy. He doesn't talk much. <gasps> My favorite. Oh. Like someone else I know. Excuse me, are you talking about me? Mm-hmm. I know Iba really well. We were partners six years ago. <sighs> we sure were. When I was hired at Abyss, I was supposed to get Marco transplanted into my left eye. But he wasn't finished yet. So instead, I got Iba. But Iba and Date. Yeah, Iba and Date were kind of fighting at the time, <laughs> and I needed to see if I was compatible with an AI ball at all, so... I see. So do they have to take out your eye before they know if you're compatible or not, I guess? <laughs> that's that's a lot. So you might just be out an eye? For a bit, yeah. I mean... Until they check compatibility. I think I'd take the risk, but... Yeah. I apologize. I do not remember anything from back then. Oh. Because of the explosion, right. Yes. It's kind of sad. I made so many memories with you, Iva. Oh. Oh, right, and she was blind left eye to begin with. Yes, yes, yes. It was fate. So when are we going to meet Marco, please? Yeah, right. <laughs> so why were Iva and Date fighting? Um. Well, you see, I, I was so preoccupied with my work. No, it was because you tried watching VR porn while Iba was still in your left eye. <laughs> that does sound like something that would make me very angry. Oh my god. I told you a million times it was just a watermelon splitting video. So, about Uru. Well, I can't really say anything more than what's in the file. Uru Somazuki. He's the child that was kidnapped from Ion when he was six. It was Chikara and Tokiko who took him. They Tracked him down to and sedated him. him. Furoe's donor. <laughs> like some sort of animal. It's, it it's, still gets me it's, every it's time. It's a lot. <laughs> like some sort of like wacky cartoon villains, you know? Right. Like uh, like Wario and Waluigi. Just fucking <laughs> skulking around with tranquilizer guns looking for orphans to put them in their underground editing bin. <laughs> Harvest Grow me more garlic. <laughs> <laughs> Wah. Wah. I'm gonna sit on him and knock him out with my noxious gas. Oh my I want to transplant all your organs into garlic. Oh god. So for over a decade, they did surgery after surgery, giving more and more of Uru to Jin. Half of his face too. The skin he lost was replaced by an artificial skin made of carbon chitin. Could you imagine if they went and found another orphan to no. <laughs> put back to Jin's body? 
like Tokiko gets to know Jin, feels bad about harvesting all of Jin's organs, goes to get another, another orphan. orphan. <laughs> it's just the cycle of orphans. It continues in perpetuity. I end up making a meat dragon, clearly. <laughs> uh, yeah. Half his face was transplanted onto Jin's as well. Right. And it was only half because Jin had a percent-shaped birthmark on the left side of his face. I wonder if anyone's ever, like, had a picture like this on their Tinder profile. It can be a little two-faced sometimes, but... <laughs> like a face-off profile picture? Sacred. Yeah. Just all of my pictures, but half my face is Nicolas Cage. Yeah. <laughs> People would and dig Chikara, it. And Shikara, being a devoted follower, couldn't get himself to rip that skin off. Which is why the left half of Jin's face was left untouched. And after all those transplants, Jin's body ended up being cut in half. Sure did. Six years later, February of this year, Uru's body was cut in half. So what was discovered was Jin's right half and Uru's left half. Jin and Uru are essentially mirror images of one another. So when the police were identifying Uru's body, they got their DNA sample to compare against from Jin's organs. And because those were originally taken from Uru, it naturally follows that they match. Naturally. So that's why... That is the mistake that caused investigators to believe that they were the same person. Babies. Babies. What martial art are you good mm -hmm. at? I think I said capoeira. Capoeira? Capoeira. Sistema. Love you both and love all in chat too. Heart. Sife! Thank the... you, Sife! Thanks, Sife. Is that the JoJo martial art? Is it true you can breathe a certain way to not feel pain? Yeah, you could just not breathe. Oh. Eventually. Oh. Won't feel anything. What happened until now? I wanted to ask Shoma about the genetic experiments, so I visited him. Ah. And I looked like Gen. So it didn't raise any concerns. <laughs> he told me a lot. About his body and his older sister. And about the hidden safe. That's what we came here for. Wait, Shoma has an older sister? Yeah. You know her well. Kizuna and Iris's friend. A mermaid at Sunfish Pocket. A mame doi. Really? I've been wondering, six years ago, why did Uru cut the bodies in half? That was for the Nirvana Initiative, right? Yeah, but what does that have to do with the plan? And speaking of, is the Nirvana Initiative still happening? I mean, after all, Terra's dead. Right, the Mastermind is dead. But you saw it, on the night of the 13th, on the rooftop of Misaton. <laughs> That was terror. It was definitely Uru's voice, but Uru should have been dead. Perhaps his voice was recorded. Listen, we live in the world of the Vochocolo. Wow, I can't. You did a good job remembering Vocolocho? that. Vocolocho? Yeah, either one of those. Probably. The Vochocobo. That's absolutely correct. Anything's freaking possible. Voices don't mean anything anymore when no. you introduce that kind of tech. Right? I mean, Date was literally parading around his Gen. It's the same thing. Either way, the rehearsal happened even after Terror died. Which means... The main event will likely still happen as well. Yeah, it's safe to assume it will proceed as planned. But I still don't understand the full scope of the Nirvana Initiative. When? Where? How? We are completely in the dark. Why don't you ask the culprit? Yeah, good idea. Hey, Uru, what's up with your plan, you assholes? No, that's not what I meant. There are other culprits. Whoever killed Uru and Tokiko. The nice guys. You believe they might know something about the Nirvana Initiative? Just look up r slash nice guys. I'm sure they're there. <laughs> talking about their plan and shit. Absolutely. Make, making memes about launching rockets off of... I don't know for sure, but they at least might have some clues. And why don't females find my rocket launcher attractive? Yeah. My rocket's too big. We don't have enough information yet. Looks like we're gonna need some extra help. Help? Over here. Come with me.
there's nothing over here. You would think that, right? But check this out. Open sesame! <laughs> wow, so cool. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, so cool. Marco, <laughs> please. I'd like to meet Marco, please. Also, where's Ryuki now? Mentally stable Ryuki? What is this? Yeah. Do you like it? It's erotic, isn't it? Uh... Huh? How is this in any way erotic? Much more erotic than watermelon splitting. Let's get going. Y yeah. Or Rubik's Cube solving. There's nothing erotic about that. I mean... Oh. What? There huh. were two! <sighs> ah, speak of the devil. There he is. Oh, I, I missed him. What does this mean? There was a tiny Ryuki at the bottom. A tiny mentally exactly stable Ryuki? See. There are two cathedrals? That's right. They've been split in half. Mizuki, look. Ryuki. Ryuki. I'm here too. Hey, why doesn't Marco talk? Tama. How is Ryuki doing? Terrible. It was a bad idea to show him this place. He's been like this for hours. Because, yeah, we kind of forgot that Ryuki was kind of, you know, mentally stable somewhere and would ramble off a bunch of jargon whenever he saw the videos as well. The torch is lit. Date and the others must have lit it earlier. Thank you. That was that was what was on my mind about all of this. I was about to throw this game out for that inconsistency, but mystery solved, I suppose. Stupid shameless man. <laughs> she seems a little pissed. Oh yeah, about Ryuki. Do you hate Ryuki? Of course I do. Oh. I want to shove a pipe in his mouth and stir up his organs. Wow. Okay. Okay, now that is a little... Six years ago, he... Oh, yes. It made my heart condition worse. Yes. Oh, my work. Oh. 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 Hospital all the time. And that was the my heart comment. Yeah, and yes. we're like, what? Mizuki doesn't have heart problems. It's the other person. Yeah. Oh. Ah. But when I heard you recently joined Abyss, I shadowed you. And February 10th, when you went to the stadium, I got there before you and found the corpse. At the time, I had no clue it was Uru's left half, but I knew it had to do with the HB case from six years ago. I told you before that the one thing I wanted ah. was for you to live a normal life. There you go. I couldn't let you get caught up in this case. I had to stop you. Permanently. That's why... Seems like a, a rash. I see. You shot at Mizuki to dissuade her from finding the corpse. Two cathedrals. Marco, can you send Iba the data? <gasps> oh! Got it. Opening it. It is a cross section of the We don't the even two get like cathedrals. a dot dot dot. You get it now? There's one on the east and one on the west. I'm starting to think Marco might not have a model. <gasps> Which would be sad. But Marco's Terror a, blew a model up the citizen. One. This one right here. Which happens to be the same side Ryuki met Terror. What he called his execution chamber. Man, I can't imagine giving these blueprints to the contractor and just being like, or making them beforehand, just being like, uh, 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 copy and paste and, and flip. And that mysterious box. Yeah, that was The one connected to the Nice building is the east one. You can take the elevator up to the president's office. So I hear that Marco just it doesn't get a model in the game, oh. but has a model. Do you want to see it? Uh, sure. One second. Let me let me save the image. Takes a moment. 
takes a moment unknown image two you're not image two anymore you're now Marco Marco oh, hold on there we go it took a sec to load bam there's Marco oh so introverted uh, it's me I don't have much to say. Reminds me of something. Uh, Abathor. Oh. From uh, <laughs> StarCraft. So sad. you are just introverted. It's not sad. It's Whoa, just being Tama's introverted. Whoa, huge. Yeah, Tama's got the hips and dips to Dang. make you quips. Why two cathedrals? Huh. It's me. Maybe it has something to do with what Nice believes. And you never know when you need to blow one up. Two and one? I think they were obsessed with that. Yeah. Damn corporations and making all their buildings have the DNA of their corporation. Dumb, stupid. <sighs> Why are you here? You know, are you okay? He appears to at least be breathing. It might not be if there was rope and a branch in here. Oof. Wow, we're... <laughs> yeah. This has been eating at Ryuki for the past six years. He regretted what he did and blamed himself. He betrayed Date and shot Mizuki Kuranushi with stun bullets. <laughs> and what happened to Mizuki, Date, and Kizuna on top of that? Yeah, Terra detonated the bomb, but it was Ryuki who told Date about this place. If he never did, Kizuna and Mizuki wouldn't have been hurt. That's what's been plaguing him. He started drinking, which made the whole thing worse. What? I don't care if he feels bad about it. I still don't forgive him. Easy. He had his reasons. But this is limited to the self-destruct program. If I activate it, she'll be lost forever. Ouch. Trolley problem with an AI and, and BB. What about the self destruct program in Tama? I was overhauled completely during maintenance a few years back, and that function was deleted. That's when Ryuki opened up about what happened. Why didn't you share this earlier? I couldn't. Ryuki betrayed Abyss. He did something you can't come back from. I couldn't let anyone find out. So you protected him. It's the same reason I didn't upload the investigation data from six years ago. I made an oath. No matter what, I'll... I will protect Ryuki. Oh boy. But Ryuki himself could have informed us sooner. You should know why he didn't do that. Why he gave in to Terra's demands. He wanted to protect his loved ones. Wouldn't you do the same? Oh. Why are you here? Date called me. Yeah, I told him to head over to the other cathedral. Does that mean he saw Uru's corpse in Tokiko's file? He did, yep. And then he came here through the hidden passage. Ryuki, you made a mistake. But lying around here in all your misery isn't gonna fix anything. If you really regret what you did, Solve this case. That's the only way to atone. You can still hear Date's voice. Ryuki, <laughs> right? I remember one night we went out drinking. You told me about your little brother. You always talk about him when you drink. You made him a promise, right? He said, I'll become a hero of justice. If I've fallen, I just need to get back up again. You used to say it all the time. It doesn't matter how many times you fall. As long as you have a body to do it, you climb back up again. Come on, Ryuki. Climb above the debris. It doesn't matter if you're pitiful. It doesn't matter if you show vulnerability. You struggle, you crawl, and you make it back to the top. I really hope we get a scene of 
where you could just rolling over the rubble and then crawling up the stairs to Date. <laughs> just all the while making like the Tina uh, Belcher. Uh, <laughs> well, I know I said that, but I didn't mean literally. That's what we do. That's what makes us human. Mr. Date. Everyone. Is that his hand? I, it's like a, a choker. Or a watch, yeah. I, I, <laughs> Ryuki, now's not the time to cry. Come climb up here. You mean. Don't get me wrong. I'll only forgive you after we solve this case. His brother's watch, yeah, I was thinking that. So. Why he doesn't like the clocks. <laughs> Broken clocks, I think. Okay. The gang's all together now. After that, we all shared information. Aiba, Tama, Maruko. Maruko. Huh. Maruko. I, I thought it was Marco, but Maruko. Maruko. Shared everything on the local network. I think it's oopsie. Daddy received everything as well via the device implanted in his eye socket. Anything that wasn't recorded electronically, we shared verbally. Yeah, they're interchangeable. Everything from six years ago. Everything from this year. All the information, including Somnia, from top to bottom. So, the first thing on the agenda is stopping the Nirvana Initiative. When? Where? How? We don't know anything about it. Hmm? We should know everything except where. Tama shared all her data, right? I did receive the information. I didn't give it a close look. Ryuki, can you tell us more about the Nirvana Initiative? Yeah, I'll explain everything in order. First, Terror, Uru, created a video. Let's see it. Oh. Oh, you can actually talk to people. I thought he was gonna keep going. I guess I'll keep going. Marco is a shy precious bean, don't pressure them. They'll speak up when they feel comfortable. They are also non-binary. Represent. The Marco oh, cool. Protection Squad! And I guess they are never Marco. comfortable. <laughs> Sad, <laughs> but understandable. Thanks. One more, one more. I actually thinking. want to stick something else into Ryuki and stir up his organs. Mari but not Don't. through his mouth greater oh. than. And oh. then uh, that disappears to a guy whose little head does all the thinking. Oh. <laughs> Maridu! Thank you. Oh. Um. Why are you talking to me? It's Ryuki's turn, isn't it? She's gotten over Ryuki. Um, Don't worry about me. You should talk to Ryuki. Yeah, GG. It was... It was something. So about the videos? Uru created three videos. QR video, Nirvana Trial, and Nirvana X. The QR video was the first. If we were to do, uh, do a new emote, I kind of want the one with the, like, derpy dog. It's kind of like a Shiba Inu or something. I don't know. Not quite the Doge dog, but you know. I guess, I don't know. But one with the with the bat. It's the a Shiba Inu, the bonk dog. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It is a Shiba Inu. But he's like melted almost. Yeah, it's it's droopy. Yeah. They're very uh, droopy. The QR code on the signboard in Jin's bonk. body. That was a link to the video, right? Right. So it was first made public six years ago on February 10th. The motive was... Uh... Yeah, the horny bonk dog, that one. There were stories about people who went missing after watching the video, but... It was actually the second video that caused people to go missing. The Nirvana trial. You have to look into it. So about the Nirvana trial... It was uploaded on February 9th. Back when Uru was still alive. But what for? I think it was a beta version of Nirvana X, the third video, for testing purposes for the main event. 
Testing what? There was a code, like BATS-490, in the Nirvana trial video. That code led to the Eastern Cathedral. The coordinates led to the staircase. Yeah, but that door has tons of locks. Right, but the staircase had another code. By solving that, you could collect the numerous keys located all over the city. Oh. And those who did solve everything would be able to unlock the door to the Eastern Cathedral. Did you notice the box? Inside was a device that shot TC Purge. Wait a second. Are we just explaining how to become a Jedi in that old Star Wars MMO? Star Wars Galaxies or something? Well, that's the old one. There's uh, Knights of uh, the Old Republic. Yeah, because there was the old, old MMO where like... Yeah, Galaxies. Yeah, where it was basically impossible to become a Jedi. I think Very only a few, few people, people did. Very few people became Jedi, yeah. So I think it's something like that, but IRL. If you open the box, it triggers. Except you don't become a Jedi, you just get knocked the fuck out. Yeah. Or, I guess, crazy gas. So about TC Purge. When it enters the brain, it can even overwrite the DNA structure inside neurons. It can make you see things, make you dance. It makes you do weird things over and over. And it spreads in the air. If this virus gets out somehow, the human race is in for a rough trip. Can you picture it? The whole world going crazy. People everywhere doing it. The unpredictable things, crazy things, over and over. And then you I'll said like honest. Florida, right? Yeah, I okay, good. TC Perch. I really hope that at some point in this game, like the rocket goes off and there's like a bad ending or something and they just play like spring break clips from Florida. Florida. <laughs> <laughs> because I opened the box. Oh. But it's okay. Ryuki has developed a resistance to it. Have you, buddy? And you can't spread it either. Have you, buddy? Having said that, TC Purge is still a problem. Before the body develops a resistance, it can spread. Not to mention the neurons that are damaged can't be repaired. That's why Ryuki was acting weird. Is that what it looked like? When I was infected with TC Purge, my symptoms got worse. Disorientation, short-term memory loss, hallucinations. He's been seeing hallucinations for six years now. The mental trauma of what happened to his brother. Anyway, those who solved the code and opened the box contracted TC Purge. And as a result, they started acting strangely. And now, there are people dancing and riding in the streets. And a lot of suicides. I see. These people would have no motivation to return home. That's why so many people went missing. In other words, Uru's experiments were a success. He's dead now, but his plan is still alive. I'm guessing his lackeys are carrying out the plan now. To raise the curtain on the main event. Babies. How hard do you like your ramen? Uh, oh, steamed is interesting. Never had that. Uh, I would say... No, I like it normal. Normal. So brave. Normal's nice. I wish you could have lived a normal lifey. Oh. Wow. Hey. It's Date E. Date E. I don't think we've seen what Date has to say, so that'll be fun. <clears throat> Main event. I think I know what they're gonna do. They're gonna shoot the rocket somewhere. With TC Purge on the warhead. The rocket will explode. And the virus will spread? Yeah. Most likely, yes. Tons of people will get infected with TC Purge. It will grow in their bodies. And inevitably spread. From one person to another. If we do things that are beyond the comprehension of the designer, simultaneously, this will lead all mankind to reach Moksha, an emancipation from this fictional world. Even if this Nirvana thing turns out to be bullshit, the virus itself is a problem. Right. I don't know if it will really cause glitches to appear or anything, but it'll be mass hysteria. 
there is already an uptick in suicides. When's the plan gonna happen? The final video, Nirvana X, is already public. Uh -oh. There's a seven digit number, which is probably a time and a date. February 15th, 12 o'clock. No. I oh. that. Iba, what time is it now? 7.55 a.m. We barely have four hours left. Time for one final investigation. Where is it going to happen? Well, we don't know. My guess is the other letters that were in the video are some kind of code too. Maybe they point to a location. Are you using the, the tools we learned? Um. It's at the shrine. No. I converted the letters to numbers and checked the coordinates. It's an area in the Pacific Ocean. No land around. I don't think those coordinates are where the plan is happening. Then where could it be? Oh, I remember something BB said earlier. What? The culprit who killed Uru and Tokiko. Maybe they have a clue. Mm. Right. Well, in that case, there is one person. I don't know if they're the culprit, but they might have some valuable information. I didn't know where to find them before, but I've got a good idea now. That person... Sunfish Pocket Amame Doi. She's probably with Shoma. Uh-huh. Damn. Maybe not Sunfish Pocket, but I'm right. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, what? They both have the Adora Rabbit stickers, too? Hey man, some things are genetic. Standard issue. Oh, and Zero says uh, they translated the code. Jimmy's stuck in the well again. Ah. And that you should like the video and subscribe to the Nyan Cave. Maybe That's if so Jimmy weird, wasn't dude. so freaking smart with his gigantic head, he wouldn't get stuck in the well so often. Stuck in the well again, Jimmy. I understand. I'll tell you the truth. Oh wow. Is this? Amame. The corpse in the freezer at Brahmin. I'm the reason it's there. It's my fault. Six years ago, February 11th. My father called me here. Totally. Shoma wasn't here. Okay, Dad. Only my father and half a corpse. You gonna finish that or? Mommy told us that Jin's body was hidden under the floor. In the same body, half that, uh, in the, yeah. <laughs> Mommy said that she'd take care of it. She brought it to Gen and they stored it in the freezer at Brahmin. Genny didn't do anything wrong. I asked him to do it. And Shoma has nothing to do with this. He just found out too. Mommy, that's not what we're here to ask. Uh, we're looking for the person who killed Terror and Tokiko. What? Terror is dead? We didn't have time to explain everything. We told them about Terror's identity and the Nirvana Initiative as quickly as we could. You can tell us more about what you know at the station. Oh. Amame, will you come with us? No, no! I don't care what you say! You can't take Big Sis away! I agree with Shoma. I don't want you taking Amame away. Uh-oh. What's the problem? We just want to talk. Wait, Amame, did you kill Terror and Tokiko? What are you saying? Amame didn't kill anyone! I knew it. Also, do you think that after they put the body in the freezer and then Gen threw the key in the ocean. Gen had a thought and he was like, maybe I should have just thrown the body in the ocean. That's, that's a good call. That's kind of a good call. All right. Shoma. Why are you protecting Mame, huh? I won't let you. She's my sister. But we're not here to arrest Mame. The statute of limitations for abandoning a corpse is three years. Only? Really? Well, I have, uh... She can't be prosecuted for hiding a body six years ago. But... I have some bodies to drop off at Japan, apparently. <laughs> I have a bad feeling. A bad feeling? If she's not guilty of anything, then that's all the more reason you can't take her. 
I'm not gonna let anyone drag her away. I already lost my dad. If you take big sis, I'm gonna... I'm... He gonna morb. He gonna morb. When I was in first grade, Big Sis gave me a radio-controlled toy. That's how I got into building things. She took me to robot expos and bought me books and parts. And she's working hard to save money to send me to college. I'm Ame's best dad. <laughs> These last six years have been hell. It was hard and painful. Sometimes I wanted to die, but she's always cheered me up and supported me. During all of the gene therapy. Big Sis always protected me. Now it's my turn to protect her. She's more important to me than my own life. So, so, if you're going to take her, you're going to have to kill me first. Okay, wow, that, that's a bit dramatic. We're not killing anyone. Shoma. <laughs> oh no. No, no, don't. I, I can't handle. Shoma. Do you hate terror? The man who killed your father? <laughs> Terror's plan is still ongoing. The Nirvana Initiative? It's going to bring nice madness to the whole world. We need to talk to Mame in order to stop it. Do you want Terror to win? Don't you want to stop his plan? Destroy his ambitions? Isn't that the only way to get closure for your father's death? If you resent Terror, if you want revenge, please, we need your help, Shoma. Again, move aside. Sorry. I can't let you do that. Uh. I came here to protect Amame. Date, if only you didn't find the body in the freezer. I'm trying to tell you we're not here to arrest anyone. But I just can't let you. Gen, you're not making any sense. Hold on. Are you hiding something? Uh-oh. No. Uh-oh, secrets. Can you x-ray? Can you look in the closet? Because the robot's out here. Oh, you can look in the closet. No. What are you looking at? Oh. Nothing. Can you not look around my room? It's kind of rude. Can you? Is he hiding something? What about the Kotatsu? Okay. You, <laughs> I thought maybe you could look at the Kotatsu and be like, you can look under the Kotatsu too. I gotta finish these though. You gotta finish Mame these. Mame accepted every part of me. She saw me for who I was. It wasn't out of pity or sympathy. Her accepting me came naturally, like it was nothing. I've never met anyone like her, and I need to care for her the way she's cared for me. I promise to protect Amame, so I can't let you. Kenny. That's all the more reason, then. If you really have those feelings for her. But look, look at her arms. What, what shape are they making? X. What's on, her, what's on her dresses? X. X's. How many X's are there? Uh. Five. Um. Unless there's someone or but two, then nine. <gasps> if we do nothing, terror will accomplish his mission. A terrible virus is going to spread. <laughs> the world will devolve into chaos. No one will be safe. Not even a mame. No. So you need to help us. We need Mame's information to stop this plan. Amame must know something. Are you okay with ruining her future? Don't you want to protect her? Then please. What do you- what's your take on this robot? You finished that robot, right? Oh, uh, yeah. You named it Roboji, huh? Oh, Roboji. Yeah. It's the second one, like a second child, so I named him Roboji. He's much more powerful than before. It can hold so much more weight than the previous model. <laughs> Think of the Wait dead bodies Who you can cares? list. Or left. Uh, I mean... <laughs> Could you people just leave? You people, I thought we were friends. It's the monowheel robot, Roboji. Um... We don't have much time. We need to do something about Shoma and Genny. BB. The guy who doesn't put the toilet seat down. Of course he doesn't. 
I don't either. I know. It bothers me. What? Yeah. There, there's like no girls living here. It doesn't matter. I grew up with only only with people who hunted the toilet seat down. So it's just a natural thing for me to put the toilet seat down. But I, I pee like four or five times a day. Oh. And I maybe poop once. Oh. So like logically, you just keep it up. Because otherwise I got to put it up and down, up and down, up and down. Oh no. I'm not going to wash my hands next time. <laughs> and then I'm going to do my work on your computer. And, oh, knowing me. Oh, oh no, no, he doesn't put the toilet seat down. It works both ways, jackass. <laughs> I was just enjoying your pity party. I have to touch the toilet seat to put it down. That's what you're pity partying about. It bothers you. It doesn't bother me. You're the most problem. Ah, I mean, it's my bathroom. So, I mean, if you don't want to adhere to the rules of my bathroom, then I'll have to shit in your bed. I I'm guess. gonna start peeing all over your bathroom. Don't pee in my bathroom. By the way, did you get rid of the Cleone in the fridge? <gasps> the Cleone. No. <laughs> no. Oh, Ryuki. It's Ryuki. He seems stable. I like. Oh my God. Everyone took off their shoes. Yeah. But BB put shoes on. Because <laughs> slippers. You gotta keep. You, keep BB it. has like Hobbit feet. <laughs> Oh, I love that as a, a real thing. BB has hobbit feet. Are you okay? What? The TC Perch? I told you already. I've developed a resistance to it. This is going to come into play later for sure. But your brain's neurons were still affected, right? Yeah, but those symptoms are being held in check with some special medicine. It's not mass produced, so we can't give it to too many people, if that's what you're thinking. Oh, man. How do you make this medicine? <laughs> I, like, I hope this happens, but I'm, I'm hoping that, like, everyone gets hit by TC Purge and we have to play as Ryuki because he's the only one who's sane. Oh, that would be so much fun. And we have fun. to deal with everyone's, like, crazy thing, like, a freaking, um, you know, uh, what do you call them? The Nanny? No, like, what you do before a wedding, a, a, a bride, bride, bride. Bridesmaid? Bride, yeah, with, with the bridesmaids, you go out and you get drunk and stuff. A stag party? I, I guess so, is, is. Is this a stag? A hen party? I don't know. I forget what they're called. All right. Oh, wait. Mame. The reason we want to talk to Mame. Mame, you know something important, don't you? <laughs> a bachelorette party. Thanks, Matt. Thank you, Matt. Something about the Nirvana Initiative and Terror. Uh. Maybe something about Tokiko. That's what we're here to find out. Whoa. Whoa! Man, but I also want to x-ray this closet. I know, right? What's but in I there? don't know if it's going to ruin everything, I you know? I know, right? What, what, what's in like, there? What if I miss all that text? Because I am interested in that stuff. But I also... What if I never see what's in the closet, you know? Right? Excuse me. So about Komeji... Um. Well, I know this is a touchy subject, so let me say it. Terror killed okay. Komeji, your father. It stands to reason that you absolutely despise Terror. I mean... Are you saying she killed him? That's ridiculous! February 10th this year. No, you know what? Six years ago on February 13th. Six years ago on February 13th, you saw Terror, didn't you, Mame? At Studio Devita? What happened back then? What did he say? You still haven't told us. I looked into her head yesterday, but there was nothing on what happened at Devita. But in the Somnium, Mame said, Nirvana collected genocide. Which would mean you know something about the Nirvana Initiative. February 10th this year. Five days ago, on February 10th, did you meet with Tokiko? We don't have hard evidence, but a witness saw you. Anyway, Mommy headed into Horadori Institute by herself. I saw another person follow her in right after. It was Tokiko. Tokiko Shigure, president of Nice Japan. February 12th this Ryuki year. Ryuki looked into Tokiko's head. Three days ago, on February 12th. He saw Tokiko threatening someone. I saw everything. If you don't do as I say, I'm sure you know where this is going. Could Tokiko have been threatening you, Amame? 
I need you to cut me in half. Like, honestly, if she takes off her hair and it's Tokiko under there... Shut up. That their is, outfits are really similar. That is not... Oh, no. That is not going to happen. I don't think it's going to happen, but if it happens... I won't be okay with that happening. I won't be okay with it either. X-ray. Oh, oh! No way. A thermite bomb. That's more what? than one. You're right. It sure is. That little... The heck is going on here? Hey, Shoma, what is this? Uh, it's drugs? a bomb. A thermite bomb. <laughs> I know that. It's a bomb. It's a bomb. Then why did you ask? Why is it here? I made it. You made it? Thermite reactions are pretty simple. You can make one easily using common products. Uh-oh. But why did you make it? Well, to get revenge for my dad. Oh. I wanted to get terror. Uh, you were going to use this on him? Yeah, but I guess it has no use now. Terror is dead, right? <laughs> what were you gonna- oh, Damn it! You just made the situation so much worse. Let's decide what to do about that later. Right. There is a more pressing issue. What are we going to do? The two of them aren't going to budge. <sighs> I really don't want to do this. But if we have to use force... No! You can't do this! Yeah, I won't let you take Big Sis! Yanni... Shoma... That's enough. Amame... Big Sis... It's okay. I'll come back right away. Promise. Are you sure? Yeah. You promise? I promise. Now, Mame. Let's go. Are we going back into a Mame? Oh! Oh. Here we go again. Is Ryuki gonna be okay? We left him there. Oh. Well, we had to. Uh. We couldn't just leave the bomb unattended. So you left Ryuki to keep an eye on things. The bomb squad should be headed to Shoma's house right now. Oh boy. It's quite a shock though. Amame was the one who killed Uru and Tokiko. I never said that. But she's suspicious as all hell, isn't she? Yes. She is. Regardless of how suspicious she is, she should know something about the Nirvana Initiative. When Ryuki synced into her yesterday, he didn't find anything. Do not worry. I received the Somnium data from Pama. Because we are returning for a second time, we should be able to go deeper than we did previously. All right, we're ready to go. Start it up. I'm sure you already know this, but the time limit inside Somnium is... Oh my god, all right already. Did you say it one more time, I'm gonna sock you. I think... Okay, okay. He's just doing his job. He's only said it once, hasn't he? I, I would say a couple times Let's at least. Begin. Said at least once. At least once this game. Boss's face. Oh boy. Okay. Gosh. Oh. Oh, I love anglerfish. I love anglerfish. Anglerfish is your favorite uh, made at Sunfish Pocket? Oh, yeah. So good at angling all my money. That's the TV. Also, listen, if your workplace ever becomes your somnium, it might be time to quit. <laughs> Unless it's your home. Welcome um. to the quiz show, Faith to Face. I am your host, Andy's co -Meiji. A quiz show? It disappeared. 
I don't know anything. Huh? It's really so interesting. We're on the other side of the TV now. Because before we were in the studio where the quiz show was taking place. Oh, and we yes. were looking at Amame through the thing. And now we're They're on the other side. Really neat. Mame? Mizuki, the data we got from Tama might come in handy. It's from when Ryuki synced with Amame. Right. When we shared information at the cathedral earlier. I extracted the evidence data that looked promising and converted it to a more usable format. Project this outward, and the structure of this Somnium world will waver and unveil hidden information. In other words, if we show Mame the intel we got from Tama, we'll get a reaction. Yes, but not just a Mame. You can use the information to target many things in this Somnium. So you're saying I can target, like, objects? Correct. If anything looks fishy, I'll try it out. The details are under look. View the information there. According to Tama's info, in the previous sync, there was a quiz battle. This is the first stage, the scavenger quiz. Amame likes music and voices. Oh. She collected many different kinds of sounds. She became highly skilled in gaining information from sounds. Uh -oh. So that might mean that there's information in the sound of Mame Somnium. During this sync, we should focus on the sound. This is Mame Somnium from yesterday. Ryuki and Tama competed in a quiz battle to get this information. The information is as follows. Amame was often troubled, but when in doubt, she always chose the right option. When in doubt or when needing to hide something, she chose the option on the right. Huh. Thusly, all the occult quiz answers were on the right side. Oh. So that wasn't just by chance. Oh. This may be a common rule in Amame Somnium. Interesting. Memory and wound. This is information Ryuki and Tama acquired playing the Spot the Difference game in Amame Somnium. Amame came across many wounded things. Important things. The heart. Blood. She carries all of that damage inside. All the correct answers were bloodied or otherwise damaged when playing the Spot the Difference game. So we should look out for damaged things during the sink. Yes. Let's keep that in mind. More information we got from Ryuki regarding Mame's sink. Nirvana, collected, genocide. Amame said these words. That has to be about the Nirvana initiative. Most likely. Mame must know something. This is the reason Ryuki decided to sink into Amame. According to the investigation, there was a high likelihood Amame saw terror when she found Komiji's body, but this has not yet been confirmed. That's all of it. Looks promising for the investigation. Yes. Let's use this wisely. Now, Aiba. Got it. Somnium scan, activate. Wow. Wum. Oh, Volkman. Volkman stereo? Okay. Ripped up magazines. Headphones. Her brother's headphones. Amame. Amame. <gasps> Amame's Amame mouth. Amame mouth. Amame, Amame ears. ear. Amame's eye. Okay. Amame head. That's an axe. Amame eye. Oh my god. It was hear no evil, speak no evil, axe. No. See no evil. evil. <laughs> Amame knows information about the Nirvana Initiative, but for some reason, she's hiding it. You see until you got from Ryuki to find out. Eight mental locks. More than usual. That shows how strongly she is willing to hide her secret. Let's try talking to her first. Hey, cut the mental locks in half, you know what you get? Three mental locks. Currently, Amame has a secret which she covers with a lie. In this Somnium, expecting objects will make evidence appear. You can check the obtained evidence by pressing control. When checking something, you can select the show evidence option to choose evidence from among the options. Let the music play. So we're basically point and click adventure now. Yay. Tell me where to hide your important books. Uh, toilet tank. That's where dealers sell their goods. <laughs> I, shall I shall play the things. <laughs> 
as an apology for Sneil pay for Yuki's therapy. Monodoof, you can't do that when you are the therapist. It doesn't work like that. Monodoof! Go perform therapy upon Ryuki. Thank you. Normal misbe- Oh. Oh. He? Ho. Oh. Oh. Ho. Oh. Oh. It's a mame. Talk? Oh, Lady Lolo! Thanks, Lady Lolo. Thank you, Lady Lolo. He? You okay, Brian? Brian, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, gone. I'm gonna reboot Brian. One second. Rebooting Brian. Normal misbehaving child. Oops, I'm past my curfew. Shoma. Oops, I made several bombs. <laughs> my B. That's some Home Alone shit right there. It really is. And then Thank the, you, Lady Lolo. Thank you. And then the burglars will trip the thermite reaction. Burning down the house. Amame, can you tell me what you know about the Nirvana Initiative? I don't know. I don't know anything. The same answer. It seems suspicious. Oh, Omelette. According to the info Tama gave us, she has to know something. Would you like to show her the evidence? It might cause a reaction. Let's show her some evidence. Yeah, show her the evidence. When uh -oh, her sneeze. hidden truth is uncovered, the veil of lies <laughs> crumbles. Ooh, one ninth. Damn. It's a mame. Show evidence. I don't think you have any evidence with which to show, but that's fine. I do. How oh. What Amame said in yesterday's sink. You do. Well, let's confirm the details. This is information Ryuki got from Amame during yesterday's sink. Nirvana collected genocide is what Mame said. She has to be talking about the Nirvana mm. initiative. Yes. We should show her this. Here, on top of the time for, uh, spent for selections, every time you use show, time will be depleted. When you're correct with show evidence, the current total time will be depleted. Look does not deplete time, so organize your information and choose wisely. Ooh. This doesn't seem like it's going to be very meme -y. Amame, yesterday you said Nirvana collected genocide. Though it was in a dream. You were talking about the Nirvana Initiative, correct? It was just an internet rumor. What site was it on? She's not saying anymore. I would like to keep questioning her, but I don't think we have anything that can draw more out of her. Let's check other locations. According to Tama... The characteristics we are looking for are something related to sound, something damaged, and right side only. From a certain time, I'm on my blank. Blank, 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 blank. Blank, blank, blank. What's that omelet do, though? Mmm, fromage? <laughs> Nothing. Are like a buzz song Brian? 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 Okay, Brian's not here anymore. Brian's left. Pewter from afar says, six minutes, beach. Ah. Ha, gotcha. Thank you. Damn you, Pewter. A Vogueman. Six minutes, A cassette beach. tape player. It's the one Mame always has on her. Press play. Fast forward. Show, show evidence. evidence. What do you think of this, Sony Volkman? I mean, Sobe Volkman. Uh, I guess we could show it information in sound, right? A Volkman. Cool. This is creepy. Can you turn it off? My favorite song. Whose voice was that? The sound was too distorted to tell. Dying. The evidence was related to sound. Why not try it on this? What? The Volkman? <gasps> you were yes. right. It might trigger a change. A blank has no blank. <gasps> oh, two times. Ooh. Oh my uh, gosh. Crap. Oh. I'm really paid for that one. Like a lot. Damn. <laughs> Why'd Iba stop the jams? Was that your song, Jerry? Were, were you were you jamming in the club? A TV. I have to use the bathroom. Continue without me. Be right back. Watch this video two times as well. Could you imagine? 
Good. Break it. I'm sorry. Not in the mood. Oh, what? Yo, what? Mizuki, you have five minutes left. What? Now it's over there. But I can't interact with it. Well, there goes our two times at least. What did I get in return? Oh, nice. Wow. Evoke man. Uh, sure. I'll use this, I guess. Uh, oh, show evidence, of course. Uh, information and sound. It's Mame's voice. The sound was distorted in the beginning. I was able to make out some words. Huh. Oh, it disappeared. We got the evidence. It should be fine. It's not information she got from the internet. Let's show Mame again. From a certain time, Mame started having reoccurring dreams. Oh, one and two, eh? So, information and sound was updated, and, uh, what Mame said. Okay, yeah. Oh, what? No way! Oh, no. Oh, of course. I didn't see that. Amame, you heard about the Nirvana Initiative from someone. We have an idea of who that person was, but let's set that aside for now. In any case, you couldn't forget what you heard. In your dream yesterday, you said, Nirvana, collected, genocide, Amame. Answer me, what is the Nirvana Initiative? I don't know. Is that Uru? Learned about the Nirvana Initiative. I wonder if Ryuki like spilled all those Wikipedia articles onto them. How nice is involved? A question with no answer has no blank. Stop! Uh oh. Barrier. Deploy. I don't know anything. What's this? This is Amame's defensive reaction. She really wants to hide something. However, it appears to be permeable. Oh. We are one step closer. We should continue to evaluate how she reacts to get the information we are looking for. Let's look around. Looks like a lot changed. We are looking for something related to sound, something damaged, and right side only. All right. Well, something damaged is pretty straightforward. It's Date's porno mags. Here they are. It is in pieces, but I can determine that this is some kind of a cult magazine. Uh huh. This was not here before. Why is it in pieces? Piece together, read, or scatter. Wow, 80. Uh, well, I guess we can use a one nine. Oh, wait, but I probably have to piece it together first, right? Yeah, let's try piecing it together. Oh man, if this is like a two times or something, it's gonna be so bad. Ah! A book on Nai's teachings. Mame? Do you have some kind of connection with Nai's? I read about it online. That is not possible. This information is not available online. Is Amame lying? Yes. I wonder why the occult magazine turned into that book. Perhaps due to this Somnium, everything is presenting a false appearance, hiding its true identity. A false appearance? Hey Mizuki, doesn't this book look like just the right side? Oh, can we use the evidence? 
kind of looks like the left side. Nice teachings. Only the right side. Oh, it's four seconds to read it now, but also show it up. It's probably a bad timey too. We're about to have a bad timey. Ah, uh, show evidence. Uh, show nice teachings to nice book. Right. By combining the scattered pieces of the occult magazine, it transformed into a book of nice teachings. The book was torn, however. Only the right side remained. The left side was nowhere to be found. I'm curious about how she saw the book. I've got to go with the right side secret, I imagine. Ooh. Uh, what? This is the truth. Is this the glass? That seems to be the case. That doll was the one in the Nye's president's yeah. office. If Amame knows about it, Amame. Tokiko just says like forty in the back that she's constantly breaking to prove a point. <laughs> Tokiko's Tokiko put her brain in Amame's body <gasps> through the sink machine that was in the warehouse. The what, wait, what about the eyes missing though? Unless it's a fake eye. I don't know. Unless it's another way of doing it. I'm just, I'm just guess. That's that's my my big brain guess. Mame, did you go to the president's office? Well, Mame, I always talked about it with Iris, the secret society of Nyes. I was curious, so I went to seek them out. That means she could have heard about the Nirvana Initiative from Tokiko. Maybe it was so insane to her that it scared her, and she wanted to hide it. If that was the reason, she could have simply told us at this point. Yeah, true. There's another reason she can't tell us. But why would Tokiko dream about Sunfish Pocket? Because when you spend too enough time uh. in someone else's body, your brain conforms to the form. Sunfish pocket doesn't just leave your mind. Why do you think everyone keeps going back there? Why is everything stinky? Barrier. Oh. Oh, <gasps> the elephants! The elephants from the video! It's an elephant figure. Amame's personal belonging. Pet head put on your head. Could you, would it would it punish me for this? I mean 64 seconds worth, yes. I mean, seven. seven seconds worth. <laughs> Travis, you gonna address the elephant in the room? Ah. <laughs> so, one last try. Yeah, put it on your head. I refuse. Oh. Oh. Do we just lose the evidence if that happens? Has she refused other things? Yeah. No. Refused to break the TV, and then the TV just left. Oh, and equals four. That's good. This is suspicious. Who is it? Inspect, talk, show evidence. Uh, I use the equals four on the four. Yeah. yeah. It's one ninth. Talk. Who are you? Simulation. Tell me your name. Simulation. Not gonna answer, huh? Perhaps this individual is a nice devotee. Oh no! This is everything's getting more stinky as Inspect. time goes on. Is there anything that stands out that might give away who it is? Hmm. With them looking like this, you have about four minutes left. Well, oh, it's getting purple. Two way eh? simulation. By showing the Nye's book the right side proof, it turned into a glass doll. And it was cracked. This broken doll matches the one in the president's office. Why does Mame know about this? I'm gonna try this. Which would mean this person would be, yeah, maybe better confirm this with one more piece of evidence would be Nice's teachings. Yeah, and it would be Tokiko. With you ...and subconsciously stored information related to you. The reason the doll appeared in the Somnium 
is because Amame went to your room. And the reason Nai's teachings were found here is because she met you. Which would make you... Tokiko Shigure? The code, the code to, the to the basement, basement is 4901095. Huh? It is Tokiko. We should ask her what relationship she had with Amame. Yeah, let's show her the evidence. From a certain time, Amame started ha having reoccurring dreams. The people, what happened, the patterns were all similar. Oh, one second, I gotta think about this. He's going to go pee in my toilet, and he's going to leave the toilet seat up. I heard him close the bathroom door. He's going to pee in my toilet with the toilet seat up. And he's going to leave it up when he's done, and he's not going to watch his hands, and he's going to come here and he's going to touch my stuff. I'm not going in after him. <laughs> He's the brave one for going in after me, let's be real. The audacity! The how could he? Oh, yeah, I'll go use the upstairs bathroom. That's what I'll do. My day's going pretty well. We went to Costco. We got some stuff. So I've been doing well with that. Uh... Love Costco days. They're my favorite. I really don't know what three things to show here, so I'm so glad that Clay's thinking about it right now. Because I'm not. I think the toilet looks so not aesthetic when it's up. When the toilet seat's up. Did you wash your hands? I guess you'll have to find out. I guess we'll have to find out. You want to taste? No! <laughs> the hidden elevator leading from the president's office to the basement cathedral. The access code. After showing the blue figure this evidence, they revealed the code. That would mean the blue person is Tokiko, and Mame heard her say it. Oh, we freeze a lot of our Costco stuff, Ellen. It's how we make it work. Show. Uh, Mame must have gotten it from Tokyo, or was dropping eaves. Either way, she was in the room. The proof is... Show. If Mame knows about this, she must have been in Tokiko's room. She also said that she was seeking them out because she was curious. But there's no solid proof she met with Tokiko yet. The proof for that would be... Show. Amame, have you seen a book of Nai's teachings? They only exist in Nai's facilities. And the broken glass doll, that was in the Nye's president's office, Tokiko's room. And you knew the access code that only Tokiko should know. What happened between you and Tokiko? Tell me everything, Amame. Well... I saw everything. If you don't do as I say... I'm sure you know where this is going. I can't run from it. I need to do it. Threatened by Tokiko. Hmm. A question with no answer has no right or wrong. Even so... I knew it. Amame was being threatened by Tokiko. Oh. Oh. I don't know! I don't know anything! Wait. Tokiko was murdered. W what are you trying to say? Mame would never do that! Tokiko had some kind of leverage over Amame. Some kind of secret. To keep her quiet. That would be motive. No. Oh, and one more thing. I'm listening to a Date Shoma. was explaining this at the mm. Enda household earlier. Amame has motive to kill terror as well. 
Her father was killed by terror. Andy's Komeji. How long should whis whiskey be aged? Uh, 50 years. Some go for, oh wow, 10 million yen. Have you drank one before? Maybe. Actually, definitely. Oh, really? In video games. Oh. Such as Yakuza, which we'll be <gasps> playing after this. Woo! This is from six years ago. It's the sign that was stabbed into Jin Furroway's body. The QR code leads to the ViewCube video. It was linked to the QR video. Read QR code. Read sign. I saw the sign. Read the QR code for the oh. video. It takes me to the QR video page. Excellent. Yep. As expected. The sign. Fray to free. Perhaps meaning a fight for freedom. Free could also perhaps be referring to moksha. Ouch. But if we take frayer and make it player, then that's play to plea. Play to... Oh. This is exactly how he was found. So his body is inside the bag. I like how they have the square head for this yeah. one. <laughs> right. Open it or show evidence. Um... I'm gonna walk away from this one for just a second. <gasps> what? My waifu! My waifu! waifu. Uh. A photo of a deep sea fish. If there was ever a meme here, it was right here. How is it? How is it? Take photo. It seems okay to take, but we shouldn't. Was that a m where a mama usually is? I believe so, me. yeah. Careful now. Does that mean a mame's bait? I believe so, yeah. These all okay, all those portraits look like like you'd see them above a urinal. Oh, what 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 kind of urinals are you going where to? Where they're like I don't know, the ones where they like laugh at you. Where they're like, oh. "Ugh. Nice cock, bro." Yeah. <laughs> you ever see those pictures? No. Okay. <laughs> It is a jacket belonging to Usually Andy's Komeji. Ads for vapes. Just smell it. <laughs> Don't smell it. Just smell it. Don't smell it. Just smell it. Okay, we're smelling it. I already told you I do not have a sense of smell. <sighs> yes, but you can detect smells. But you can detect smell, right? It smells like petroleum-based detergent. Huh. I assume it was taken to the cleaners. I'm guessing it's a smell she still remembers. A question with no answer has no right or wrong. It is a jack- Huh. There is something here. A receipt from a discount supermarket. Cream Everest Flan. Super Sweet Heartburn Cafe Au Lait Blood Sugar Raising Super Chocolate Donut <laughs> Komeji likes sweets And how come his daughter is so salty? Oh. A body bag Yeah, because Yonaharu she works in something's pocket Enda, AKA Andy's Komeji Was found inside Open, show evidence. <laughs> it was the sweets that killed Komeji. <laughs> this man clearly died of old age. <laughs> oh god. Uh, yeah, let's open it because I don't know what I would just show it yet. I could the receipts, show it the receipts, right? The receipts, yeah. Yonaharu Enda. She saw the mutilated body of her own father. It must have shaken her to the core. She was pretty off, I remember. Totally zoned out, like she wasn't even there. That's to be expected, though. It's not the kind of thing you just forget. Right. We got info from Tama regarding when the body was found. Let's show that evidence. Oh, here comes the times, too. Yep. 
Oh crap. Oh, this is bad. This is not not great. A body bag. Yonaharu Enda, aka Andy's Komeji, was found inside. <laughs> that was weird. Rouge of love! Travis! Nayani. I put down the toilet seat. Clay. I leave up the toilet seat. Chat. You guys have toilet seats? Me. Toilets? A Don't you have bag. windows? Yo oh. Thank you, Travis. This is how they did it back in the day. It is how they did it. Oh. Chamber pots. So... I guess I have to eat this. Yeah, you've done it now, haven't you? 48 seconds. Mm. I can do 32. This hurts so bad. I'm gonna try to play one more thing. I don't think anyone oh. has mentioned this yet. The stage name Andy's Comedy has two meanings when flipped. Comedy and Desu and Comedy and Death. Oh, oh. Comedian Death. <laughs> Thank you, Simon. Brian's back, I guess. Sometimes. Please don't times two that. Terror's Iron Mask. Six years ago, at the studio, I saw them. I was trying to untie Ryuki, and they came in, pushing a stretcher. So I ran. But they caught me. Next thing I knew, I had a gun pointed at me. As Ryuki suspected, Amame had contact with Terror, Uru. At that time, she probably did not realize that inside the body bag was Komeji's corpse. But when Ryuki regained consciousness, Amame saw it, and... She realized the man in the iron mask she saw was the person who killed him. Checks out. Yes. Mizuki, you have less than two minutes left. Oh. Please hurry. Another oh, times another two. times two. That's oh. rude. 21. 21. Thank you, 21, for being a golden waffle. Oh, there it is, F2. <sighs> I knew it. Um Uno. So Amame is being threatened by Tokiko, and we take that information and we put it where? Or I guess we gather the rest of the information. I it is a jacket. Yeah, I think I need the receipts. Yes. I don't know. It might actually, that might be like a red herring. We might not even need that. Because it seems a little irrelevant, but maybe, who knows? The anglerfish? Or the fray to free sign? We took the photo last time. We did take the photo. Oh, Amame's next to the angler fish. A photo of a deep sea fish. It's literally trying to eat her. It's not a mame, is it? That's a mame. The oh, where's the hair? The hair ends right there. Uh, take photo. Hair stripe. How is it? I'm so curious about how is it. What do you mean, how is it? It is just your standard run-of-the-mill triple wart sea devil. Oh. A triple wart sea devil. A fo- You all triple wart sea devil, you. That's not a mame. That's not a mame. I guess it that is a mame. Okay to take, but we shouldn't. The fish is, is a mame. Standard triple wart sea devil, you know. Standard issue. This is. I guess I can just equals four this, and then, well, it's going to be 24. 28 equals four. I think we can use this on a bigger one. So I'm going to go with the one third for now. And it was, did you see the murderer? Oh, it only divided the initial part, not the rest of it. Terror's iron mask. Where did it? Six years ago. 
at the studio. studio. I saw them. Three minutes left, Mizuki. Careful now. Ah, uh, and that times two. Ouch! Maybe you can free the fray. Maybe there's a, a small option on free the fray, but is it just gonna give you another times two? I don't remember getting a one wrench. from there. A wrench! I'm gonna see if there's... Cause I don't think we got anything at free to fray, right? We did both of them? Uh, I don't know. Inspect or touch. Wow, those are high high values. Well, that one's eight, so it's not so bad. It just becomes sixteen. I don't know if we're gonna find much lower than eight, so. It is a normal wrench. It appears to have been used. I wonder if it's Mame's. No, it is not. There is a faint handprint on the handle. The handprint is bigger than Mame's palm. It must belong to someone else. Well, not Shoma. Yeah, right. A wrench. I'm going to... You're going to touch it? Touch it. Touch it! There is nowhere to use this. I didn't say use it. I said to touch it. So big hands probably again, eh? Could be. Oh, what's over there? Uh, headphones, I believe. Oh, headphones. Yes, of course. Um. The terror mask. Yeah, right? Shoma's headphones. Show evidence or put it on. Do you think we could show the evidence of, um... Because I feel like I'm getting another times two from this. I'm getting slapped with them a lot. Let's go with one eight. Show evidence. Oh. Information in sound. Sure. Sure. Nice. Huh. I can hear something. Since Shoma's gone. Since Shoma's gone. I'm gonna borrow this. I'm gonna borrow. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. The robot? Yeah, yeah. Oh Shoma's no. Robot. Yeah. Shoma's robot with her? And we know. Oh, that makes a lot of sense now. I used it to go shopping. Uh-huh. That's it. Shopping for what? Lies. I don't mean to burst your bubble, girl, but you lying. The center circle at the stadium. It is highly likely that it was that monowheel robot that carried Uru's body there. Right, but... <laughs> she got something great there at half off. Oh, Without God. using the slicer, it's impossible. Mame didn't know that the slicer was in the basement of Horidori Institute. But maybe I Shoma did. Yeah. It's a whole conspiracy. So the ter did the terror mask turn? It did. No. It it's it's rotated. It? Oh, has it? Ever so it's it's now looking at the free to fray sign. No, it's not. I don't know. It's all wacky. It, oh, it's only half. Yeah. That's why it looks like Broken it turned. In half down the middle. It is the left side, or depending on how you look at it, the right side of the wearer. Oh no. Indeed. Let's call it the right eye side. Hmm. Do you have the evidence where it's like the right half thing? Yeah, I think I do. Right side secret. This is statue. The statue at Horadori Institute. Oh, was it? <gasps> oh no. Code. The code. Nothing looks off about it at first glance, but there's gotta be something. <gasps> she was there. It, we said that we like yeah. felt or heard something, yeah. right? Yeah. We should search this place. Oh, it's a Kingdom Hearts cutscene. Oh no. Kingdom Hearts cutscene. You're giving me too many stairs. Lately, I 
thought I heard something. I think you're just hearing. I really hope it just turns around. Just do 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 do. <laughs> yes. <laughs> It is a little past 12 a.m. on the 13th. This is the conversation that was held in the basement of Horadori Institute. So, what we were hearing was Mame? If she was not present, this conversation would not have played. Mame knew how to get to the basement. <laughs> I suppose she was headed there on that day too. But she heard your voices and scrambled to hide. Why? That's where Tokiko's left half was, correct? Oh. Oh, I'm like, full bars. <laughs> You're like, this is a graph. What's full bars? This is a graph. Basement. There's stairs. There's stairs. It's funny, uh, like, I would have read it as stairs if the lines were filled in. Are you accusing me? We have this much proof. I think you have an idea of what Amame did. Mizuki. Hey, Mizuki. Yeah. Mizuki, you're an abyss investigator. You need to face the truth. I know. I know. I'll do this right. I like how we're still not even halfway through. I know, right? There is a lot to be uncovered here. Oh, damn. Oh, it's, it's out of order? Yeah, I don't know why either. That's weird. What evidence proves uh, what Amame did? Um, well, the code. Okay, it's not out of order. More information to share. Threatened by Tokiko. Uh, saw the murderer. Is it legitimately everything except for Komeji like sweet? Uh, yes. Um, borrowed the one wheel uh, 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 basement of Hordori. Those could be swapped, but. Amame, you killed Uru to get revenge for your father, correct? Who liked sweets. But Tokiko saw you and blackmailed you. You killed her to keep her quiet. Then, you left Tokiko's right half in the president's office, and the left half remained in the basement of Horadori Institute. <laughs> You're not so smart. So many mistakes. Uh-oh. Ah! Running would be a pain in the ass. I need to carry it. Killed Uru. Killed Uru. Okay. Choose an, an answer. answer. Checkpoint saved. Mommy. <laughs> Mommy, what's wrong? Mame's realized we're out of time. What? Yeah. No. Oh. Can't really do much else at the time. <laughs> Six minutes, Mizuki. <laughs> Six minutes. Six minutes. Well, gosh. Gosh. This uh, somnium sure is disturbing. Use a timey on clay. I ah, I don't have any timeys, but I have these to give him. Thank you, though. Uh, what do you guys think? Uh, think we might finish tomorrow if we uh, if we go a little long. If we go a little I long, saved. tomorrow's yeah. our long day for uh, it's side quest day. Side quest day in Xenoblade Chronicles three tomorrow. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I know it's a a teeny touch early, but I just don't want to start more arcs. This this reveal feels It feels like a good place. Nicer to end on. Absolutely, cuz I'm fully intrigued for tomorrow. Tomorrow sounds doable. Nice, nice. We have quite a bit to go. Okay, okay. Maybe 2 days the epilogue is long. Ooh. 
two streams, Wednesday. Yeah, because we could just do one longer stream tomorrow and do Xenoblade the next day. <laughs> what? We could just do, yeah, all I tomorrow, if all you, Xenoblade the next day? you guys want to have a, an extended I. Zero thinks it'll be two streams because the epilogue and other stuff, and Zero is very confident. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, do you want to... Yeah, Zero wanna... is speaking in the third person. It feels good to speak in the third person sometimes. Zero likes this. Um, yeah, yeah, do you want to do uh, Unless you an want extra, to extra long stream tomorrow? Yeah, uh, sure. Yeah, we can have a, an extended ending scene because, I mean, yeah, I, I don't want to... I don't want to end on like the end of the thing right? and then the epilogue. Right I the know. Next stream. Yeah, it never so, feels too good. So, so we're gonna we're gonna do that. Yeah. So we'll, we'll yeah we'll basically commit to finishing I tomorrow. Uh, from what it sounds like, and whether it takes you know three or four hours, um, that's fine. And if there's time for some Xenoblade, we'll do that. If not, then we'll uh, then we'll, we'll, we'll do we'll, Wednesday, we'll that Wednesday Xenoblade. Yeah. So one long stream tomorrow, but if there is some time, uh, like if it happens faster than we anticipated, then maybe we'll do some Xenoblade. That's exciting! But yeah. Uh, do you want to collect uh, the post-game stuff and things for I1 again? Uh, I think so. I'm, scr I'm, I'm, I'm scrambling through my memory, Travis. Uh, yeah. I think we could do something like that. As long as it doesn't take too, too long. Um, but yeah. It'd be fun, too, if there was any super silly things we missed in Somniums that are, that are good. Mmm. I don't know about like combing through like everything, but yeah. Uh, the po there's a post game thing to do with this game that might take some time. Okay, well I mean we're gonna have time tomorrow, so yeah. So we'll figure it out. It's it's always tough because we don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah, can't. It's hard to make plans I when can just we tell don't tell you that we'll be know. here doing yeah, it. Yeah, we'll do our, <laughs> We'll try our best. All right. There's like quite a bit left. Yeah, we can always do it tomorrow then too. But it sounds like we'll be able to get most through like everything tomorrow. So. I think all my browser sources crashed. Spooky. Based on chat being broken, and there's also on the the the, the frame next to Monadoof's name, you can see one of the, one of the animations is stuck. Oh. So I'm gonna have to restart. I'm gonna restart OBS. Yeah. All right. Well, Xenoblade Chronicles Three coming at you very soon. All right. So grab a snack. See you soon. Thank you, everyone. Bye. Bye. I love you. Bye. Wee. Wee. <laughs> Is it still broken? I have 13,000 eyeballs. I really gotta start spending those things. What do you do? Shopping. Oh, that makes sense. Chat's broken. Is and so, so am I. Broken. Is there a way to make it not broken? Yeah, I did it. <laughs>